Hey everyone, uh, this is going to be a very quick video. I've just had a new tea and I thought I'd just show you uh, me get, basically getting it ready. Uh, this is the enclosure I'm going to be keeping it in. It's a uh, five gallon uh, storage container which I've still got to put the holes in. Hence why there's a drill there. I'm going to use some of this uh, block for it. And the spider itself, a stunning female. Um, so then it cost me a Juventus. So I'm going to get the fibre done, uh, get our soaking, and then I'm going to get the holes uh, in the enclosure done, and then I'll get her housed up. Okay then guys, it looks to get the block, and I'll put the block in the uh, big tub. And I'm going to add some warm water over it. Might add a little bit more. But for now, that will do. And I'll check on it in a second. Okay then guys, well I left this for uh, probably about 15 minutes while I was eating my dinner. And uh, as you can see, it's, uh, it's, I mean, it's, a, it's a big uh, container. And uh, it's just completely full now. So I'm gonna get this into the enclosure and then I'll be adding the spider in. Okay then guys, well I've decided I'm doing it today down in the my dining area because it's uh, nice and low and uh, my room is a bit of a mess at the moment so um, so yeah I'm going to start adding in all of this um, it's quite warm which will be nice for the spider and obviously will help it to uh, remain humid so this spider likes a lot of substrate and so that's exactly what it's going to get we're getting more on the floor to be honest. And this might still expand a little bit while it's in there. And this should be plenty. Oh, shit. <laughs> Should have just tipped it in, really. Um, so yeah, like I said, this is a five gallon enclosure. Just under, actually, it's like slightly under. Let's try and get some of this up. It is very light, it's like, uh, it's just gone 10 p.m. So you can see that this is quite full. Um, what I'm gonna do, guys, as I always do, um, this will be the front, so I'm going to put slightly more up towards the back of the enclosure. Just so it's a little bit deeper up there. I don't know why, but that's how I always do it. I'm not going to put I'm not going to put any plants in here, to be honest. I'm going to leave it like that. Um, just because this is a, obviously with it being a burrowing species. Um, and they also are very heavy webbers as well, so uh, yeah, I'm going to uh, get the spider. Okay then, well here she is. So this is a female. Um, apparently she's really aggressive, but she seems okay at the moment. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to carefully put her in her new enclosure. Oops. There you go. Come on. Okay. As I said, this is um, the S Juventus. Uh, Stella Cosmia Juventus. Uh, the Java Earth Tiger. And yeah, this was um, a friend of mine actually brought this and didn't realise how aggressive they were, so we kind of got rid of it. <laughs> and I was happy to take it off his hands for him. Um, She's lovely. Uh, I did have one of these um, a couple of years ago. A friend of mine called Alan Hicken brought me one for my um, my 22nd birthday, I think it was, which unfortunately died. Um, as soon as I had it, it went into an ICU and died. So I'm very, very happy to have a nice one here. And you can see there's plenty of substrate in there, and it's, uh, yeah. So they still feel slightly warm, um, but not 
to um, yeah, there's not enough moisture, not, not too much moisture in there. I did give it a squeeze out, um, and then obviously put it back into the tub. So there shouldn't be too much water. Obviously, these uh, spiders do like it very humid. So uh, yeah, that's uh, my new girl. And you can see she's got a big uh, old spot, so she's going to molt soon. I don't know how soon this will be, but I will uh, get a video up to show you guys. And uh, I will try and handle this tea. Uh, I'm not worried about the aggressiveness, but with it being in pre-molt, I will probably wait until she's molted before I uh, get her out and show you guys, hopefully. So yeah, that's right, so a look at her. I have a name yet. I'm trying to think of a name for a stunning female with a tent with a you know really bad temper. Um, well, there's a few girls I know I could probably name her after. <laughs> Oh, but seriously. <laughs> okay then guys, well I'm going to leave her to settle in now. I'm gonna, I am might add a couple of uh, plants and things in there just to make it look a little bit nicer. Um, and yeah, I'll give you an update. Um, probably once she's molted. Okay then guys, uh, thank you for watching. And as always, take care.